morning guys. It's uh, just after early o'clock and it's just got light about 20 minutes ago and I'm actually at Sandhurst for a couple of days. Mrs B's working so I thought why not let's go and drag ourselves off to one of my favourite places Sandhurst Lake. Just waiting for the rain to stop and then we're going to get out and we're going to go and look for some swims have a little look about see what's happening hasn't been fishing that well but hopefully it's going to start fishing now we're here always a chance when you've got the rods in the water isn't it okay i'm going to wait till it finishes raining i'm going to pack the gear on the barra go and look see if we can get a swim see if we can catch some fish see you in a while guys okay welcome back well we've pushed the barra a short distance from the car park probably about 50 yards barra's there we've got it in the car park swim because we've seen a couple of fish show quite long probably in front of 10, swim 10, and in front of uh, the pipes, but there's someone in those and they're staying in them so at least tomorrow. So we may have a move tomorrow, I've sort of booked the swim, uh, but we may have a move or we may stay if we're catching. But uh, yeah, I've come in here, car park swims, it's quite busy. This is, gives me quite a bit of area, gives me my own little bit of space as well. So I'm gonna uh, get sorted, it's really warm, it's in double figures today. Uh, yeah, it's unbelievable for this time of year really it's unprecedented isn't it so let's have a little look out there winds blowing in lovely nice southwesterly and uh, we've seen a couple so I'm going to unload the kit get sorted then we'll come back to you and see what we're doing tactics wise everything else we're going to stick them see you in a little while guys Okay, right, welcome back. We've finally sorted. The rods are out. There's the rods, you can see them. They're all done and out, rearing to go. Only fishing single tonight, I'm not putting no bait out at all. Should put a little bit out really, but I'm definitely gonna move tomorrow. At the moment, my mind's telling me to have a little move over to the right over there to a swim called the pipes that you've seen me fish before when I've done uh, a couple of these vlogs type things last winter. Last early spring, late, early spring, late winter. Fish I've seen have all been in their water, in that pipe's water. He's not going till tomorrow, so I'm getting as close as I can without interfering with his fishing. And I've stuck one out to the left. I had a little lead out there for about 17 reps, something like that, and about six foot of water. Nice silty, hardy silt area. I put the middle one straight up, straight up the end there about 16 wraps, I suppose, 17 wraps. Again, okay, nice deeper area out there. If you look on the map, you'll see these, these areas. If you go on the Sanders map, you'll, you'll see them. I'll, I'll, we'll go up there in a minute. And the right hand rod, I'll put out towards the bailiff swim. Always a good area, that between 16 and 18 wraps. It's always a good, it goes down about six and a half, seven foot deep. But this, I'll take you up here to have a look, because I'm only by, by the map now. But have a look here at the map, I'll show you. Have a look at the map there. All right, now if you see, car park's here. See these deeper areas out here? These deeper areas. In there, look at that. They're the ones. They're the ones that we want to go to. That's the ones. So, that's what I'm fishing, those deeper areas on the map. Uh, yeah, I've always done well on those at the car park. And from all the other swims, if you, if you fish sand dust, one of the questions I always get asked, oh, what, where are the spots in this swim? Where should I fish? What areas are good? Have a look at the map, get it up on your, on, on the, either on your phone or on the website, get the picture of the map that's on there, and look at those darker areas, those seven, six to eight foot areas, that silty areas they are. There's like a big channel that runs up the entire length of the lake, and also in front of eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12 and also bay lifts and the car park as well as a couple of little spots as well so some really good areas to go to check those out definitely i've done well over the years so yes we've got three singles out there white pop-ups on the multi rigs again just banging them out there just for tonight no baits and i say the fish that i've seen they've all been about 150 yards that way which is in front of the pipe swim uh, yeah, further over towards the pipe swim. Well, hopefully, fingers crossed when I go in tomorrow, they'll still be around. We might have a chance of catching one. Right, I'm going to tidy it up in there, get sorted, rods are out, all done, cup of tea, settling for the evening, and I will give you an update a bit later on before dark. 